In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to make this wooden iPad or tablet stand. Let's dive in. I set the chop saw to a 60 degree angle and cut some 4 inch wide, half inch thick poplar. Once I had that angle cut, I then measured 7 inches from the outside angles for the tablet base. I then cut the front of the stand at 1 inch. I changed my angle to 30 degrees and cut the back at 5.5 inches. Although this wood was pretty smooth, I did a quick sand with some 120 grit sandpaper over all the sides. I could not figure out a way to clamp with these angles, so my son-in-law said, hey, why don't you clamp it from the side? We did, and the glue held once we released the clamps. We used regular Gorilla wood glue. Am I there? <clears throat> All right, we'll do the same over here. And then, use that. I didn't actually think that you could clamp laterally. But evidently you can. That's pretty smooth. I'm just going to do a little light sanding touch up. Then we'll be ready. I applied my trademark field guide to DIY brand. Three, four, five, six, nineteen, twenty. I applied Watco tongue oil, which dried really quickly, allowing me to apply two coats. Here. Two coats of tongue oil, let that cure overnight, turned out great. So what that turns out to be is just the perfect tablet holder. You can also hold it sideways. Great for recipes, watching movies at your desk, whatever. And while I was at it, I cut this. This will hold any mobile phone. This even one, this one even has a case. Holds that perfectly. That's just a series of uh, cross cuts at 15 degrees. For more woodworking tips like these, click the image on the screen now.